Good morning, everybody. Sam Kimmel here, Washington Chapter Backcountry Hunters and Anglers, Region 7, coming at you. Going coos deer hunting in southern Arizona. Really look forward to this hunt every year. January can be tough. Upland bird season ended Monday. Waterfowl's just about wrapped up. Steelhead's winding down. And turkey season isn't exactly around the corner. So this hunt is has become one of my favorite times of year. Got it. This is a bow, no firearms. <laughs> we gotta, we gotta make it down the road. So, we're in southern Arizona. First morning here. Lots of deer moving around. Already put one stock on to no avail. But uh, no coos deer so far, just mule deer. Um, I'm deer kind of filtering in for water because it's so dry. We're actually struggling to find our own a little bit. I think these coos deer are gonna be on these north sides where it's a little greener, a little more cover. Um, but lots of mule deer. So stay tuned. It's not a shabby view. Alright. Morning of day two. Um, tough day yesterday. Saw a lot of mule deer. Couldn't get the coos deer figured. with a couple bucks in this morning. We're trying not to bump. So we spotted a group of about five mule deer about 300 yards up this ridge. In front of us, Smitty's taking off. He's gonna go put a stock on him. It's gonna be tough. She had you spotted from like as soon as you popped over forever and she Thank stood God. up yeah the... ranged it was 87 Oof. and then i couldn't even find the fourth bar until he came out and was already back yeah another level earth shaker rain maker didn't stick around but it's still spitting we're supposed to get this all day 
we're gonna head back to where Justin and I called in that back yesterday. Uh, try to do like a September elk setup above them and get the wind right and see if we can call them out of their beds. Uh, just a late start this morning. Everything was wet, cold. So we'll see how this goes. Um, we're hoping this weather just kicks off some movement that we've been missing. So did get into another bunch of mule deer late last night on the way to camp. Good wide buck in there. I'm still holding out for a goose deer, so we'll see how she goes today. Sat a saddle where there's a super good trail that crosses and nothing. So I think they're hunkered down a little bit. I'll probably go back to the rig. Hunt up there for a bit, see how our road is getting out of here. Well, we finished our hunt. Um, didn't get a lot of video the last day. We actually had to pull out of the mountain a day early. They had a historically heavy snowstorm. Arizona. I don't know what they ended up with on the hill we were on, but close to a foot, sounds like. Maybe, maybe 16, 18 inches even. Um, so we had to get down that road while we still could. It was a dirt road about 40 miles long. Um, so we made it out, stayed in a hotel that night. Um, it was just snowing like crazy all day, um, but fortunately we were able to fly out. Uh, just landed in Spokane and I'm headed home, but overall super fun hunt. Um, it's not a huge success all the time. Those deer are everywhere, but they're small. I call them great ghosts for a reason. Um, I missed that buck at 39 yards. That one will haunt me a little bit, uh, but anyway. Super fun. We did get to see some Coda Mondays too, um, which are apparently pretty hard to find. So, lots of pins on On X for next year. Looking forward to it. See everybody.
I'm 